All righty, welcome back. We made it to Tuesday morning, and it's foggy out here this morning. I have our camera zoomed out all the way. It's looking in the same general direction toward Rhinelander, and, well, you can't see anything this morning because of the fog that has developed out there as a result of the rain yesterday and just how soggy the air is. And the temperature and dew points also close to one another, so the air is very saturated, and we're dealing with that this morning across parts of the UP, over in the parts of Rhinelander, Tomahawk as well, Medford, and most of our viewing area having issues this morning. We're going to work on getting that fog out of here as the sun continues to rise. Meanwhile, though, we have a few clouds in western Wisconsin. Those are tracking off to the east this morning. Some showers and storms starting to develop across parts of Minnesota. These will track in our direction as we head towards the afternoon period. The storms we see over in parts of Iowa will be leaving us alone. We're also seeing more storms developing across parts of Illinois that have prompted severe thunderstorm warnings and severe thunderstorm watches this morning. And those are heading right towards central Illinois, so they'll need to keep an eye on that too throughout the morning period. But for us, it's just areas of dense fog that we're dealing with this morning. We're going to get those out of here or get that out of here. And they'll have more showers and storms for us during the afternoon period. And maybe some stronger storms across southwest Wisconsin as we head towards later this afternoon into the evening time frame. Now will track off to the south and east. Overnight for us, once the storms get out of here, just some clouds and fog will greet us again. Then once we head towards your Wednesday, the fog gets out of here. A beautiful day on the way filled with a lot of sunshine. It will be hazy out there too as more wildfire smoke will be, will be moving in. Then once we head towards early Thursday morning, just some clouds will be on the way with another system right nearby. But of course, here's the storm opportunities for it today. So there's a marginal threat out here. So some gusty winds and hail can be ruled out for the areas in the darker greens. Of course, the stronger threats will be further off towards the south and west. So nothing too ridiculous on the way for us today. But the main issue we'll have to watch out for again will be the wildfire smoke. We, we, we will have hazy skies today, but the rain may help to clean the air out for a little bit. But then we'll have more wildfire smoke on the way as we head towards Wednesday, so of course we'll keep an eye on that air quality again with that smoke that we'll be passing through. Meanwhile, though, air quality is good right now across most of the Badger State. There's a few spots that are in a moderate category, so overall nothing too ridiculous. Most of us are forecast to reach the moderate category today, and that's about it. But temperatures, we're warming up now. Lower 60s now in Eagle River, upper 50s in Lando Lakes, middle 60s over in Rhinelander, some more 60s as you head further down to the south, so already a mild morning and also a humid morning. The temperatures are really close to the dew points, so the air is not only saturated out there, but humid as it is. So that's why we have that fog out there, out there this morning, and we're going to work on getting that fog out of here throughout the daytime period. But the dew points stay up there for a while, even through parts of Friday before it goes down just a bit. But notice as we head towards the weekend, here we go again. Dew points on the rise, so that moisture will be sticking around for quite some time. Mostly cloudy today, a few showers and thunderstorms on the way. Maybe some locally heavy downpours. Also hazy again with highs in the low 80s. Southwest wind at around 5 miles per hour. By tonight, some showers and storms early. Those will be ending. Areas of dense fog overnight again with lows in the middle 60s and a wind overall looking nice and calm. Northwoods furniture and mattress, 7-day forecast. Party County Wednesday, hazy, warm and humid again with highs in the mid 80s. Some more storms as we head towards your Thursday. Before you dry out as we head towards your Friday, looking like a nice day then. Mostly sunny, warm and humid again with highs in the upper 80s, becoming less humid throughout the day. Some more storms through the weekend, although not the hugest chances. We will have some dry hours too, so you should be able to get outside. Just make sure to keep an eye to the sky whenever you venture out.